She's not up yet because she usually gets up at the same time I get up to head to her parents house so I uh, hope you guys slept well hope you guys are feeling good and regenerated and hope you guys have a good day today and if you guys have work hope you guys have a good day at work if you don't have work hope you guys have a good day at home doing whatever uh, it is currently seven uh, not seven six fifty six so I kind of got a couple minutes to vlog although I don't know what I'm gonna talk about because you know it's just now it's early so I'm still getting ready for work and I still have to make, get my lunch together and all that. So I just wanted to get a quick intro clip in saying hello to you guys and hope you guys are doing well. Um, I'm not going to the gym today because I have something going on, which I thought I had going on yesterday. So I didn't go yesterday when I could have went yesterday because I didn't have that thing going on. So uh, I was so upset. But, you know, there's always two, uh, there's always Wednesday, Thursday, Friday that I can go. So to make up for those days. But. As of right now, I gotta get out of here so I can get the rest of my lunch going, or the rest of my morning going, so I can get out the door for work. So I will see you guys later. Alrighty guys, so I am home. The parents are on their way over because my dad's gonna help me build a desk. Kimmy is rapidly getting some stuff ready. <laughs> Look at her move. <laughs> She's on the move, boy. She is getting stuff ready to, hey, you left the water on. She is getting ready to make some dinner because my mom is starving. My dad ate already, but I guarantee my dad's going to eat some eat something here. Um, but yeah, my dad's going to help me make a desk in that little spot that I showed you. I wonder what she's doing. She went in here for something. What, what are you doing? Oh, you're not even in there. You're right there. She, <laughs> I thought she was in the spare bedroom. She went into our bedroom. Um, so I can't wait to see... Uh, what the desk is going to look like because my dad said that it's not going to work the way that he thought it was going to work because there's one stud in the wall and then for the length and width that I want it to be he said won't work because there won't be another stud in the uh, wall so we're going to have to try and figure out another way to make it work which my dad's like MacGyver uh, he can make anything work he well yeah I, don't, I, I can't explain it in a short length of time but my dad is literally like uh, MacGyver, if you know what that is, it's a TV show or a movie uh, where a guy builds any builds like anything out of anything. So uh, he's literally like that. He is so good with building and with his hands. But um, yeah, so they're on the way over right now. This clip has gone on long enough. I think I'm gonna end this clip here. Alrighty, so the parents got here, and I would say we got done building the show, but my dad's the one that actually built it. So it might be kind of hard to see because there's low lighting in here. That's kind of what we're working with right now. Got the brackets on, and it's kind of off because uh, there's a stud right there and there's a stud right there, so we could only screw it in into those two points. And if I really wanted to, I could go buy another one of those brackets and uh, have it screwed into uh, a stud over here, but I don't have one because I didn't think I was going to need a third one. But that's what we're working with for right now, which works perfectly. I might get a lamp and run an extension cord because there's no plug-in in there uh, so it'd be easier if I could just have a plug-in right here and run a light and put a lamp right there but I have to run a, an extension cord because there's a plug-in behind the couch run a lamp cord underneath the door which is that, that you guys can see I run a cord underneath the door and have a lamp sitting right there so it kind of worked out cool but at the same time it's different but it works alrighty so the parents just left and we finished eating dinner my mom ended up having some chicken and rice and asparagus same with Kimmy she had chicken rice and asparagus I had on the other hand some tilapia and asparagus and rice that was really good and <clears throat> we just finished eating and they just left it got hot in our apartment so we had to put it open up a window and put a fan in there so <clears throat> excuse me I have still have food in the back of my throat apparently but yeah, so we're just relaxing the rest of the night. It may be a really short vlog today because, you know, I got off work late and, you know, we had things to do when I got home. Me and Kimmy had an appointment today that ended up taking an hour. So then after that, my parents came over and we had to cook dinner. So I didn't really get a lot of content as I'm 
planned on, but hey, at least it's something, like I've always said, something is better than nothing unless, you know, you guys comment down below and say that you'd rather have longer vlogs and only want vlogs that are only entertaining and you want me to vlog when there's something going on, but until I hear something from you guys, then I'll just keep vlogging, whether they're short or long, but <clears throat> that's the importance of me asking you guys to comment because I'll listen to you guys and your opinions and what you guys want because I also want you guys to be involved in my vlogs as well. So, But as of right now, I'm going to clean up some of the dishes that uh, we use, so I will see you guys in a second. Okay, so I found this out today at work, and I wanted to make a clip and show you guys this too. So Instagram has a new update where you can now change their logo on your home page. So I'm going to insert a screen recording here with a voiceover explaining how to do it. And no, it's not a hack. You don't have to have your iPhone jailbroken or anything. It is with version 162. That's what you have to have it updated to is version 162 or 162.0. Uh, I don't know how you say it or what the technical version of it is, but uh, I know it has to be 162. And I'll insert the screen recording with a voiceover clip right now. Alrighty, so in order to get started, you obviously have to open it. So go ahead and open it. Let it load and refresh real quick. There you go. Go ahead and click your profile at the bottom right-hand corner. Then you get to your profile. Go ahead and click the three lines at the top right-hand corner. Go to settings. Then pull down from the top of the page. And there you will find the Easter egg. And it will take you to the page where it celebrates its 10th birthday. And therefore, you can select your different logo icon. How freaking dope is that, though? Because usually, in order to change a icon logo... For an app, you'd have to have your phone or iPod or whatever you have, your smartphone, jailbroken so you can like customize it to your liking. But Instagram decided that you can now change their logo because it's their 10th birthday, I guess, and you can change it and it'll be set to like your personal settings, I guess, from now on. I don't know if they're going to delete it, next update it has or whatever, but I hope they don't because that's kind of cool. I hope they keep that feature. Um, but that's just kind of cool because you don't have to have your phone or iPod or your smartphone or whatever you have jailbroken or hacked a certain way so you can change it. That's really cool. I really like that. So good job, Instagram. Alrighty, guys. So it is getting that time of night, sadly, where I have to come to an end and end today's vlog. I first want to say that it wasn't as bad and as short as I thought it was going to be because uh, I end up getting a little bit more... Uh, footage than I thought I was going to get so I started editing on it a little bit before I just came and grabbed the camera and recorded this clip and so far I'm up to like seven and a half almost eight minutes long and I'm actually really really happy with myself because uh, before I was I felt like I was struggling to get clips and footage because I wasn't comfortable recording in front of the camera and obviously you guys have seen the difference between now and my very first vlog I was kind of a little quiet and like I guess shy if you will because I didn't know how to talk I didn't know how to react I didn't know how to just be me in front of the camera obviously that takes time and practice and the more you do it the more comfortable you'll get which is something that everybody goes through it's a phase I didn't think I was gonna go through it I did and I thought that I was gonna be one of the few people that was like oh yeah I'm just be, I'll be a natural at it no, that was far from <laughs> what I thought, but uh, I am very proud of myself because I've become more comfortable in front of the camera other than when it comes to vlogging out in public in front of large crowds of people. I'm still kind of a little hesitant and weird about it because I still think, oh, I'm going to get funny looks. You know, obviously with the rig that I have set up with my uh, shotgun mic and my tripod holder, it helps me feel a little bit more confident than just holding my phone because before it was just me talking to my phone and I wouldn't just I, I wouldn't do it at all but obviously now I feel a little bit more comfortable because people will get an idea oh he's making a video he must do you know video creation so it helps me just a little bit feel more comfortable uh, but I still have a hard time you know recording out in public but I am working on that I am trying to get better at it uh, obviously, I'll get more comfortable over time, you know, and the more uh, smaller crowds I work in, the more comfortable I'll be, and I'll eventually work up to bigger crowds. It's just right now, it's just a little weird just because I'm still starting out. I'm still a small, very, very small uh, channel where nobody knows me, 
Um, so obviously if I was a bigger channel and I had like thousands of subscribers, then I would feel a little bit more comfortable, but it's just right now nobody knows who I am. So it's like, what, it's like, what if I get that look? Oh, what is he doing? You know? So, uh, but I want, I don't want to keep rambling on, you know, I don't want to become annoying. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get off here and shut off the vlog, go ahead and get editing on the rest of it. So I uh, thank you guys for sticking with me and riding with me and I will see y'all tomorrow. So peace.